Hi guys, this is Steph, and I am about to show you how I make the most amazing P3 Chocolate Delight Protein Cups. So, here goes. You see my ingredients here? I use some chocolate syrup, I use almonds, I use virgin coconut oil, I use flaxseed, coconut, raw coconut by the way, unsweetened, I use butter flavoring, natural whey protein powder, Nestle chocolate powder, Truvia because it dissolves really well and it's the closest thing that tastes like sugar that I have had as opposed to Stevia and Splenda, etc. So anyways, here's what I do very quickly. I am not going to go into a lot of how it goes. I'm just a go now person, so here we go. So I have a half a cup of um, melted coconut oil. And see, as you can see, I can just use a regular bowl in the house. This is a small batch. I generally just make kind of small batches. Usually I maybe do a half a cup or a cup. I put my protein powder. I just did a half a scoop of that. I put in my um, sifted chocolate, and I put in two packets of Truvia already in there for you. I put in my chocolate flavoring syrup that's sugar-free. And I just stir that all together with a spoon. You don't need anything fancy, as you can see. And it will just um, dissolve very nicely. So um, the reason I really like this is because I am on the go a lot. And so there have been a couple of mornings that basically what I ate for like breakfast and in between lunch was this. So as you can see, it's thickening it up really nicely. And you can make this thinner or thicker, but this coconut oil has been melted for quite some time. So it's, it's quite melted. And then um, what I do is I take coconut flaxseed and almonds. I chop up the almonds and then I roast them and then they look like this when they're roasted. Now depending on how much you want in your uh, coconut or your protein bars, then you just put whatever amount you want. You can make um, less or more. And so then you're just going to put that in and it's, it's going to be hard and ready to go. And then you're going to put it in whatever cups you want to use. I use also a silicone um, cupcake maker and so here's the final product here and so you can see the bottom of them and how much there's the flaxseed and the coconut you've got that protein powder in there here's the smaller ones that are just like little candies and you guys and this one is with less of the um, nuts and more of the oil so but here's the deal you guys these are so delicious that you will go, why would I ever, ever eat chocolate with real sugar and garbage in it? So these are really, really good. And like I have perfected it to what my husband and I like. This is a lighter chocolate. This is a darker chocolate. Just d depends on what you do. And I really don't measure a lot of stuff. So I just kind of throw in what I want. And here's some of the things you can do different. Check this out. Coconut milk. Carnation evaporated milk. I've done the evaporated milk and cream cheese, but I've used whipped cream cheese in this and it is so Good, so but then when I tried the protein powder powder I was like, okay, this is an awesome protein bar and I have not had gains when I have eaten this so guys This is an awesome choice for if you're on the run and just a great p3 life maintenance protein bar So you guys have a great day. Bye